What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the show. So I was actually not going to put a video out today, but uh, there's some really good news that just came out. So I want to talk a little bit about uh, what we've heard and where I think this is going. So it looks like the Majority Leader Schumer and Manchin, Senator Manchin, have reached a verbal deal when it comes to this uh, reconciliation bill. Okay, so we've been talking about the Build Back Better, that bill failed, and they had a Build Back Better second version. And this second version, it seems like they have an agreement. Okay, now this is a verbal agreement. And so what that means is there's nothing on paper. We don't know how the rest of the senators, uh, Democratic senators feel about this, but it does sound like uh, Senator Manchin and Senator Schumer are on the same page when it comes to moving forward with this reconciliation bill. So the the holdup before, Senator Manchin said he didn't want to move on climate change, uh, some climate change provisions, and he also didn't want to um, what they call tax the rich. But it looks like he has changed his tune and it looks like this is something that could potentially pass in the Senate. Now, the the what we're looking at when it comes to passing in the Senate, you need all 50 Senate Democrats to vote for this bill in order for it to pass. And they're going to pass it through reconciliation, which means right now they're not going to get any support from the Republicans. So you have 50 Democrats, you have 50 Republicans, you're going to get all 50 Senate Democrats to vote for it, and then you're going to have the Vice President Kamala Harris come in and break the tie, and that will be the reconciliation bill uh, that they they move forward with. And so, just looking at the calendar when it comes to the senators and, and the in the House, uh, the House will go on recess next week, and the Senate will stay next week, and then they'll go on recess uh, after that. And so, in August, we're looking at. Uh, pretty much they're going to be on recess the whole time. Uh, the House will be on recess the whole uh, time, and then you'll have the Senate on recess for about three weeks, which means that if this were to go anywhere, they, they need to wait for the Senate first. And so if these senators can theoretically get something on paper by next week, then we could see a vote in the Senate next week. And if the Senate can approve this, that would mean that it moves to the House, and the House would have to call a special session so they can come in and vote uh, for this bill. But uh, it's, it's good news. It is good news that it seems like at this point we will have some type of um, Build Back Better style uh, bill. And so right now in the current state of talks, we have Medicare. They're going to be able to negotiate prices for not not for every every uh, medication, but for some. Uh, so that's good. And then the climate provisions uh, that's going to be in there. And then also it looks like a 15 percent uh, kind of a. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be like a flat tax, but it's going to be like a 15% tax for corporations. Uh, so they can't go lower than that. Uh, you have some corporations that don't pay any taxes at all because they, they use a lot of write-offs. Uh, so that's what we're looking at right now. And I just wanted to bring this to you. I will be uh, moving out of this apartment and I will be going to another location. And so I'm packing all my stuff up. You guys probably see that in the background there. And uh, so I just want to do this little quick video. And I will, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to put a video out tomorrow, Friday, but um, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Once I get settled again, then I'll be able to put videos out on a regular, regular basis, but sometimes that transition, I'm not able to put a video out or I have to use my, uh, my GoPro and, and shoot the video like this. Okay, one more thing I do wanna mention. Uh, it looks like we are technically in a recession because we've had uh, two consecutive quarters of, of negative growth, and so, I think the vast majority of people, and there were there were some polls that were put out, like 50% of the American people think that we're in a recession already. We were in a recession even before this information today. Uh, so it, it really comes down to how people feel about this. So if you have Americans feeling like we're in a recession, then we're pretty much in a recession because that changes the way they spend. And that's the big problem. Uh, if, you, if we're in a recession, people are gonna spend differently. They're going to not buy items that they would normally buy because the fear of the recession getting worse. And so right now, technically we are in a recession, but our economy is still on fire. And that's what's crazy about this. It's starting to slow down a little bit. Our economy is starting to slow down a little bit. And that's because the Federal Reserve is raising interest rates. And so we're gonna have to see how this all plays out. This is kind of a weird, a real weird economy right now because 
Uh, technically, we're in a recession, but when we're looking at the economy, it's good. When we're looking at the, the jobs market, it's good. And so we're just going to have to see if that changes. If the job market starts to change and people start losing jobs, then we're really going to be in a bad situation. So it's just something we want to follow. But I, do, I did want to mention that today because uh, this is it, it's big news. It is big news that technically we are in a recession. If you guys have any questions, post them down below. If you guys have any questions about anything I talked about, I want to know how you feel about the 50 Senate Democrats, you think they'll be able to pull it together? You have Senator Manchin that's saying that he's on board. Will Senator Sinema be on board? That's a that's a question that uh, we need to find out, right? And so let me know in the comment section how you think about that. Do you think all Senate Democrats will come on board so they can get this, this Build Back Better bill uh, through? If you guys have any other questions, post them down below. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe for more, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye.